We're now into week five of the course, and we're talking about what we're going to call the Ithaca response to a lot of the problems that we've seen with the global industrial food system. Why do we call it the Ithaca response? In a way, just because we live in Ithaca, we're not trying to be pretentious, but there is a sort of characteristic to college towns. Ithaca has three major educational institutions and to places where there are a lot of educated and relatively privileged people um, as they create their food landscapes. Um, they tend to go for things like organic and local and non-GMOs, which is usually part of organic, and um, the kind of thing that, you know, even their restaurants should be farm to table, the animals should be well treated and so forth. And they tend to think that this is a virtuous or ethically preferable way to go for nutrition purposes, for community purposes, for economic or at least local economic purposes, um, as well as for animals. So we want to evaluate this and take seriously the claim that it's ethically superior in this unit. We've looked at some of the considerations going um, all the way along in the first four weeks, but now we want to really focus in. We also want to look at the criticisms. We want to think about the fact that Ithaca is part of Tompkins County. You see this bumper sticker around on people's Volvos here that says, Ithaca, New York, 10 square miles of paradise surrounded by reality. And there is a sense in which Tompkins County and the broader upstate New York area is more like the real world than Ithaca. There's a lot of food insecurity. There is not a great employment situation for a lot of people. And so some of these organic, hippie, farmer's market um, options that constitute the Ithaca response may not be available to everybody. And so we want to think about that and whether this is just a kind of precious response on the part of the privileged few that couldn't really be scaled out. So we'll also consider this question of scale. Can you do pasture-raised organic um, animal agriculture, for instance, or local business food procurement restaurants that are farm to table in a manner that could be scaled to feed 7 billion, 8 billion, 9 billion people? So this is the unit on the Ithaca response.